In a recent speech given by the U.S. Space Command Deputy Commander Lieutenant General John Shaw, the future of U.S. intelligent satellite architecture was discussed. Shaw discussed how current satellites are designed to conserve fuel by minimizing movements in orbit, resulting in their service life ending once depleted. This approach poses a particular challenge for geosynchronous situational aware satellites, which monitor only specific ground target areas and are intended to operate for decades. Lieutenant General Shaw proposes a shift toward more maneuverable assets that can adapt to specific situations and better monitor adversary activities. Shaw mentioned several possible solutions, including refueling ports on new satellites for in-orbit replenishment and lower-cost satellites that would be replaced at faster intervals. Preliminary demonstrations for sustained space maneuvers are targeted for 2026, with the Space Force leading the efforts. The shift towards more maneuverable satellites has many cybersecurity implications. On the positive side, there are satellites would be better equipped to withstand physical or energetic attacks and could move out of harm's way. However, vulnerabilities may arise, such as attackers targeting thrusters to disrupt orbits. Lieutenant General Shaw also mentions the use of commercial refueling services, which introduces additional points of entry for potential attacks. Security protocols would need to be established to ensure that refueling devices do not pose a threat to the satellites they service. Overall, Lieutenant General Shaw's vision for the future of U.S. intelligence satellite architecture aims to enhance adaptability and monitoring capabilities, but will need to consider the cybersecurity challenges associated with this new approach.